you're not going to die um, if you follow your dream. But you will die if you don't, in some way. She's an atom in my hand, already gone. I find the infinite potential in a singular item. So my job is to find out how far the nail, specifically, um, can travel. And I make very high quality things incredibly simply, incredibly simply, and um, quite laboriously. I just love making it, um, and what I think resonates with people about what I do is that it, there isn't um, an answer. You don't have to know anything about art history. It's just, um, it's like music. You get it or you don't. I've, I've worked alone for 28 years um, in a tiny little cinder block box. You know, I, um, I've been a monk. This is it. This little brick room is, um, this is the epicenter of my creative existence every day. It's the best. Um, just in terms of general frontier vibe. Yeah. Yeah, authentic um, frontier vibe. Maine is a place where uh, reality rules, uh, no matter what it is. So I, I, I love the I love the gravity here. Um, I only work with nails uh, for 28 years, and um, it's because I've set up a very elegant and endless problem, which is um, have to always make something new out of the same thing. To go and work hard every day. Um, Bertrand Russell called it the zest of the ditch digger. That um, if you have physical labor in your life, um, food tastes better and experiences are richer. And I, I, I believe that. So I get to work all day on a problem I invented and uh, go home and think, God, I'm shot. I'm going to go home and be fried. <laughs> it's the best. I'm getting up and doing it again. She's come back. Too.